If you think the answer is 7, you're absolutely wrong. I know, it looks simple, right? You see 21 divided by 3 over 7 times 7, and your brain just goes, oh, the 7s cancel out, so it's just 21 divided by 3, which is 7. Easy. But that's where almost everyone goes wrong, and I mean almost everyone. And hey, my friend, only 0.5% of people who watch actually subscribe. I'm really trying to reach my first 1,000 subscribers. So if you enjoy these kinds of math mind benders, please consider subscribing. All right, let's come to the point. The problem is this, 21 divided by 3 over 7 times 7. Now, the main confusion happens because of how we read it. When we see 3 over 7, our mind jumps to fraction mode. We think it's stuck together, so we try to simplify too early. But the rule of math, specifically PEMDAS, says something different. That stands for parentheses, exponents, multiplication and division, addition and subtraction. And here's the key. Multiplication and division are at the same level of priority. They're handled from left to right, not whichever you feel like doing first. So let's apply that properly. Start from the left. 21 divided by 3 over 7 times 7. We first do 21 divided by 3 over 7. Now, dividing by a fraction means multiplying by its reciprocal. So that becomes 21 times 7 over 3. Let's do that step. 21 times 7 over 3 equals 21 times 7 divided by 3, which is 147 divided by 3 equals 49. All right, now we still have that times 7 left from the original equation. So 49 times 7 equals 343. Boom, that's the real answer. So the correct answer is 343, not 7. Crazy, right? If you don't believe it, just type 21 divided by 3 over 7 times 7 into your calculator and see what happens. If you still have doubts, please write down in the comments. Thanks for watching.